Hey folks, this is Vince with Ads Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to check out The Islander. This is a game that you can find on Steam for about three bucks. I just got my press copy, so this is going to be a first impressions video. Here's a look at the main menu, New Island and Load Island. Let's go ahead and start a new one. There is a settings menu in the bottom right-hand corner. It's not too, uh, not too involved. You've got a full screen windowed option here. Uh, you've got music and sound toggles. I'm not sure what that hand and the arrow does. Um, there's no tool tips, so I don't want to click on it and then, you know, mess something up. So we'll just, we'll just leave it like that then. All right, so we can do a random island or a regular island. I guess we'll do a random one. Okay, so I'm not exactly sure what this is about. Um, I guess we'll just take a look around the interface first. The upper left-hand corner... There's money, then you've got like starfish and hearts. I'm not sure what that's all about. Now can I click? I can zoom out with the mouse wheel. Okay, so this is the map I'm assuming. Alright, how do I... Oh, I think this means I can move stuff, perhaps. Okay, there's nothing for me to move right now. What, what's this do? This hammer. Ah! Okay, so with the hammer, I can clear out trees and rocks. Alright, what's this top one do? It's a little bucket. Uh, doesn't look like it does anything at the moment. Okay. On the very bottom, there's a little button. Okay, so it looks like I can plant... I'm guessing that's wheat. Alright, I'm going to assume this is sort of like Plantera, only it's a bit more Stardew Valley-esque. Uh, it's a, it's like Stardew Valley, at least I think, because it's more farming and pixel-oriented. Uh, Plantera is more of like a 2D clicker, where you could put trees down and other things. Uh, here it's a top-down view, and again, it's, it's similar to Stardew Valley. Uh, I guess we'll put these down and see... All right, so each one costs money to do. All right, there it goes. So I can zoom all the way down to this level, or I can zoom all the way out to this level. W, A, S, D lets me move or pan the camera. This guy doesn't seem to do anything, though. He just sort of stands there. I wonder if the bucket is for collect. Ah, I just have to hover my mouse over the grain or the wheat, and it collects it automatically. That's nice. Okay. So this is one of the... It's a simplistic idler, which, you know, is fine with me. I love playing Plantera and games like it. I guess in the meantime, we'll clear out more space. So I'm guessing that little starfish is your current level. The heart, I'm not too sure about yet. And if this game is like other games like Plantera and Idle Clickers, uh, you're going to level up and unlock more stuff as you do it. Yeah, okay. Let's collect this real quick. Oh, there's this. Can I click? oh nice. 15 starfish. Okay, I guess it's experience. Okay, so if we click down here, yeah, we need five starfish to unlock this next one. Two starfish to unlock this first one under this tab. Trees. Looks like animal pens. I think this is just pathing. Yeah, wooden path. Probably decorative. This is grass. Alright, so how does one get more land? I mean, there's... there's I wonder if we can get rid of the water or make a bridge to get over there. Maybe we have to unlock it. I'll click the parrot. All right. Um, what else can we do? There's something else here that's locked. All right. Let's just keep making more of these then. Oops. Let's try out this move feature. There we go. Cool. <laughs> In 
interesting fanfare. We unlocked the raspberry, stone path, and a cocoa bot. Okay. And it looks like these things get more expensive as we put them down. Alright, I guess we'll put down some of these here. Um, leave some space. Let's put them over here. It looks like your house gets some automatically. Money, that is. Okay, a couple more. I'm guessing the Coco Bot will automatically collect things for you. At least I'm, that's what I'm guessing, anyway. Find out pretty soon here. All right. OCD is now satisfied. Leaving an empty space there would have driven me nuts. Alright, so I gotta wonder how much this Coco bot is. I wonder if that's what the last tab was. Ah, yeah. Ten... Oh, there it goes. Okay. Why wouldn't we just buy a whole bunch? Oh, look at him go. Alright, we'll just buy an even 10. How about that? Now we don't have to click anything. We'll just focus on putting down more things. Alright, another four here would do. One. Alright, collect faster. And I don't think the stone path actually does anything. I think they're all just decorative. Alright, 157 gold for the next one. One more. I guess in the meantime, um, let's see if there's anything else we can click on in the environment to give us stuff. I don't see anything. Oh, there's this XP over there. I wonder what these hearts are all about. Hopefully we'll find that out. And how do we, how do we get over here exactly? Okay, we, I think we've got enough for one more. Yep. Okay, so now we're even on that. Pretty soon we'll be leveling up to level three and probably unlock something else. I'm going to keep an eye out for more of these star, you know, these little starfish. There's a parrot. I guess they just pop up randomly from time to time. Alright. 
It looks like the next unlock is going to be this tree. And at level 4, we'll unlock some sort of animal. Okay, so we unlocked a banana tree and it looks like a flower. Okay. I guess we'll put the uh, trees down. Uh, actually, yeah, buy my house. Well, it's shaping up to be a nice little, nice little desert island here. Me and my Coco bots just collecting resources. We'll never be hungry again. And how this stuff magically sells to, you know, these invisible traders is beyond me. But that's okay. I, I'm actually liking this. This is one of those, you know, loaded up for 5-10 minutes, relax kill some time, and then go play something else. But it's pretty fun. If you like Plantera or games like it, then um, you may want to look into this one. Again, it's three bucks on Steam. If you guys want to see the continuation of this, let me know. If you guys haven't already, subscribe to my channel and check out my official website, www.dadsgamingaddiction.com. This is Vince. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.